Okay, we happen to have Cynthia Sass with me today, who is a registered dietitian, and she has a great column in Shape Magazine, which is the Weight Loss Coach. Yes. And she is also, of course, the creator of the Flat Belly Diet, and she also wrote a book that I want to talk to her about today, which is the Ultimate Diet Log. Cynthia, just tell me, why did you create the Ultimate Diet Log, and what's really its purpose? Well, the Ultimate Diet Log is basically a food diary, and we know that people who use a food diary when they're trying to lose weight lose twice as much weight on average, according to the research. So it's kind of like that eye-opening thing that when you're really tracking what you're eating and how much you're eating and when, you really learn so much more and keep track better of how you're doing and what you're doing, um, but it's not a typical food diary. So what we did is we built in an assessment in the beginning of the Ultimate Diet Log, and it's basically what you do is you sort of track what you've been eating so that you can set some goals. So there are 17 different goals that you can pick from. It can be ranging from eating more of something, like trying to eat two fruits every day or four servings of vegetables every day, um, or it can be eating less of something. It can also be swapping one thing for another thing, like swapping um, animal-based fats for more plant-based fats or refined grains for whole grains. And we even have um, reducing emotional eating or stopping when you're full as a goal. So after you've kind of assessed what you're doing, you figure out what the priorities are for you and you can choose up to uh, four of those and you can track those along with your food diary. So if you really want to stop when you're full, that can be one of your focus areas. So as you keep your food diary every day, you're really going to heighten your awareness about that particular focus area and you're going to set a measurable goal so that at the end of the week you can check in and say, how did I do with that particular goal? If I could go back and do this week over again, what would I do differently and why? Um, if I need more support, where can I get that support? So it's just a little extra edge to your food diary. And it's for people who are, you know, you could be following your own diet or you could be just trying to make small steps or you could just try, you know, try to be more aware of what you're eating. And what we're hearing from people who are using it is that they're really happy with it because it's something that they can keep with them. It's kind of a small spiral bound book so you can just throw it in your bag or in your backpack and take it with you. And that it's really helping them to feel really positive about what they're doing because they're achieving their goals and they're seeing results and they're feeling successful and that's spurring them to want to set even more goals along the way. So. Wonderful. And where can people buy the book? They can buy it at Amazon.com, Barnes & Noble, pretty much any of the places that you can buy books. Now is Weight Loss Coach online? Weight Loss Coach, I do have a blog. If you go to shape.com and you look for the blog called Weight Loss Coach, which is the second blog in the series of blogs there, I blog three times a week. And um, it's always something that has to do with weight management, whether it be cutting calories while you boost nutrition, feeling more satisfied, little tips and tricks that help you to shave off the calories or to, to lose that weight without feeling like um, you're necessarily um, giving up your favorite foods. So uh, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, I post those blogs. Shape.com, awesome. Weight Loss Coach. Great. And then and lastly, where the can people go? The magazine. Oh, that's great. Okay. And lastly, where can people go to find out more information about you? For more about me, including uh, videos uh, that um, I do f uh, regularly for shows like ABC, The Today Show, Good Morning America, etc., you can go to CynthiaSass.com. Um, it's like sassy without the Y on the end. <laughs> All right. That's awesome. Thank you, Cynthia, and the best Thanks, of luck Dave. to you.